in a regular browser now. So to see it as you would see it, I go incognito. Then I go to the website. Now once the website is up, we're looking to look at the sample materials. So let's look at level one. When you get into the slide, there is the omnibar at the bottom. You just click it and you can make it full screen there. Then as you begin, first thing you're going to do is want to watch the video. The video is already full screen. It's playing. Okay, then you stop the video. Now what we're looking at is the story and again you're already in full screen so the interactivity will work for this one right as it is because it's in uh, Genially. This was 100% created in Genially. Now for the other stories they are what is embedded inside. So everything works here and you'll be able to write with the students at the top. There's the writing function if you want to write on the board. And then they can erase and close. Now let's check some of the other ones. Let me get out of this one. So for the level two, that would be a slide embedded in a slide because these were the earlier ones and then again you make full screen. The video, you just play the video. Okay, the video is fine and then I move over and here you're going to see a slideshow embedded within Genially so you will still have this functionality you will still be able to hear sound and you can just go back into Genially and if you want to draw on that slide you just don't don't maximize it here and then you have the the tool here if they wanted to draw on that slide again you want to maximize it the presentation here so they have the ability to draw. Okay, then you have your PDF and your MP4 that are downloadable as soon as you click on them. It'll just take a second, but it'll you'll see it come up right here for you to download. Okay, and then let's look at the last one. The same thing for the last one. This is level three. To make it full screen, you just click it and then make full screen. And this one is also an embedded presentation. So you have your video, which plays. Then you right click on. And then you can play it in this screen or you can make it even bigger. The screen is big enough. And then there's your audio. And you have your ability to draw again on the slides if you wanted to draw with the kids. And, oops, sorry. And here you would have to move it on the bottom left because this is an embedded Google slide into the presentation. So again, you move that on the bottom left. When you're ready to go on to the next part, then you move on the top right. And then they have the free drawing. And again, they have the downloadable and you would just click the MP4 if you wanted to download the MP4 to send to your student. And it just takes a second. It's now right there. So you have your MP4, but I already have it, so I don't need it. So I hope this explains a little bit of the tutorial, and I hope you enjoy the um, interactive readers, and I will do another tutorial for the others.